One of the key elements of patient rooms in hospitals, obviously, is the bathroom. And currently, our hospitals have very, very small bathrooms uh, that really don't allow uh, nurses and others to provide care and assistance within the bathrooms themselves, especially uh, during bathing. So what we've tried to do in the new hospital is create a larger room for the bathroom by eliminating the shower stall. We've created a shower environment that utilizes the size of the room for water management, et cetera, so that actually now two nurses can assist a patient in bathing. Also in access to the room, we found over time that one of the areas we have, where we have the highest incidence of falls, especially at night, is with patients trying to negotiate in opening and closing the door to the bathroom. So we've designed the bathrooms to have a sliding door that remains open at night, so the patient in bed not only has direct access to the bathroom, but direct visual access to the bathroom. And this will decrease the possibility of falls in the night in transferring patients uh, to the bathroom facility. We've learned all of this from design work that's been done in the long-term care community. And because the majority of our patients are going to be, frankly, over 65, We've picked up many, many lessons learned from that community of long-term in-home care and transferred that to the design here in the hospital. So this is just an example of that.